Hello guys, welcome to the second video of the bootstrap video series. So in the previous video, I gave you a small introduction on bootstrap. And in this video, what I'm going to do is that I will show you how we can integrate bootstrap to a project. So yeah, let's get on with it. Uh, yeah, before that, uh, I'll show you the code editor that uh, I'm using for this. So what I'm using is, uh, you may already know, some of you, uh, VS Code, uh, which stands for Visual Studio Code. Uh, it's lightweight but yet it's powerful so give it a try if uh, you are using someone else so there are many extensions here not here you can search them and get them so yeah and yeah also if you are using vs code uh, there's an extension called the live server live server yeah, live server this one so install this one because uh, it will be very easy when running our projects rather than running from here because using live server we can also run two projects simultaneously but it's pretty hard using this we'll have to open two terminals uh, yeah so using this it will be much convenient to have two projects run simultaneously and uh, yeah I'll so yes let's integrate bootstrap to a project what we have to do is just copy pasting this one and there are many ways to integrate bootstrap this uh, using the start template is one such method so the other method is downloading the source files uh, bootstrap source files and then integrating uh, linking the bootstrap.css file into our html file the usual linking yeah link rel style sheet href and the relative path to our to the bootstrap.css file which will be, which uh, will be downloaded so and yes to download that you can yeah they provide these here to downloads yeah you can download from here or else here you can download the source files and or else you can use package managers if you have node.js installed in your laptop or pc whatever uh, you can use npm i bootstrap npm i or npm install bootstrap and from that uh, those source the source files will be downloaded to your project folder and then you can link that path to html file so that's how it's done we copied them we paste this here so yes uh, yeah i already pasted this here is this again so yes this is what we just copied from there and yeah paste it here this is the body section let's have some gap here so yes this is how we integrate and it's all done we can use classes from bootstrap and they are going to work um yes and i think if uh, not if we are obviously going to have our own style sheet so for that we always have to have that style sheet below this bootstrap css style sheet or else it won't work so we always have to have our bootstrap our own sorry our own style sheet below the bootstrap css style sheet so yes that's how it's done and in the next video uh, we'll do the navbar and the header uh, section so yes see you in the next video